So okay. apparently, so, apparently we made another crime. Is it not working? We got hold up by the police. And now people on YouTube are calling her the colonizer because they know Kelly did it. You can expect a tree, but sometimes the tree is not enough for you. Another problem yet again with the car. The car. The car. The drama queen. Oh, this car is it's the biggest drama, drama queen. queen. It says it's completely empty. Going on in good hopes that we have enough fuel. Should be fine. 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 Oh, fine. And if not, then later in the video. You'll see. <laughs> you see. What's your name? We have arrived in Trugana style. We got a big feast meal upon arrival. So we are actually staying in a cute little hotel. Yes, very close by my sister. Very close by. If you want to disturb her, we can disturb, her, can disturb her anytime. Anytime you want. <laughs> my sister thought Katie would be like this, you know. <laughs> Like a big when girl. I, when I was little, I was so, so tiny. You were so small. So she never expected me to be this big. But Katie. Oh, the lights. Night riders. Night riders. The only our car on the road. We're now going back to our hotel. We haven't vlogged that much today because tomorrow is going to be a more busy day. Today was mostly traveling and eating. Yes. So uh, stay tuned for tomorrow. Someone just delivered breakfast. Yes, we didn't someone even know. I got some good news for you. Oh, okay. tell me. Let me show you. Yay! Hey! Normal voltage. The Bluetooth device is ready to pair. Hey! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but it works. Sort of. So okay. apparently, so, apparently, we made another crime. We made another crime. <laughs> I need to pay some officers, maybe. <laughs> I need to park my car with the front like this. Because all the cars are facing the mall. Yes. And except. now, you see all the cars are facing the mall, except, except for our car. car. <laughs> K, why do you do that? And we, we don't know why. And because this is not a joke. This is truly how it's it's supposed to turn. Here. They told us we are supposed to turn it only here at but this particular when we go mall. Somewhere else, they tell us no. You cannot go with your back. Yes, you need to go with front. With your front. But nobody knows why. Yes. <laughs> oh! Now back in hospital, as you can see. A couple of months ago, last year, I started jiu jitsu, mm -hmm. um, and then I got a strain on the on my uh, foot. Fisio did a lot of things. It helped it improve a little bit, but still, after taking rest, you still feel it like something is wrong. And he said, like maybe there's more to it. And then we are now at the hospital, so let's see. To maybe get an X-ray. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> At the hospital, they told us that Steven didn't need an x-ray, but that he needed an MRI, for which they didn't have the machine. So he got sent away empty-handed, but there still needed to be work done. So let's visit some companies. Hey, Kaylee. Yes. What did you just learn? Wow, we learned something new today. Wow. So apparently the rubber, I never knew. I thought rubber was always chemical and artificial, mm -hmm. but apparently at this company, they milk a tree and then the rubber comes from the tree. I don't know if I'm very, very silly. No, not you are not. This. Because I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you didn't know And as people well. tell me always, I know a lot of stuff oh. because I'm old. The fact that you didn't know, that makes me feel better. Yes, no, feel better. They, they, milk the, they milk the tree. Yes. And then it makes rubber. Yes. That's cool. Yeah. yeah. Not wow. artificial, natural. Wow. Yes, welcome to Ghana. <laughs> <laughs> Feast time. Baby girl, you're so fine, I can't get you off my mind Ooh girl, na na, ooh girl, na na Baby girl, don't need to flex, this 
40 kilometers, it's two hours driving. What you doing? I'm counting my smuggle money because every time we stopped, I need to be pulling something. Just because of the people, of the woman that is filming. I don't know what you're talking about. On our way to? To the village on stilts. The village on stilts. Yeah. Our final full day in Sacre Day, so we're using it to the fullest. Yes. And we're going to a town. Is it called? If it, is it just a name, or what's the name of the town? The name of the town is the village of Stelt. Is it, no, the no, no. Oh. The name is uh, Enzu. Enzuleo. 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 Okay. Enzuleo. <laughs> Story time. Story time. When I'm moving in Let Ghana. Turn down the radio. When I'm moving in Ghana, yes. I got stash here. Hey. Oh, see this. Why? Because I'm with game. <laughs> Police will stop me. Because every checkpoint. Every checkpoint. We get so I have stash because <laughs> you don't want to get stopped. Sometimes you get stopped and you you want you, you don't feel like giving. Then you see the cars that you pass by <laughs> will pass you again. The five minutes that I get ahead, I, it's taking back. And so our journey takes longer than even with the, with the <laughs> potholes. So that's the Ghana for me. For you? <laughs> that's the Ghana for me. Oh, what was that? This stuff. This is nuts, <clears throat> nuts and sugar? Yeah. Nuts and sugar. It's very nice. What is it called? Um. <laughs> Now you are falling through the month. It's like cutting cake. Then cake. cake. And cutting cake. Mm. Let the police come. Yes. You got everything now. Yes. You got your triangle. I got it. You got I your got fire, extinguisher. fire extinguisher. They cannot take Ooh. anything anymore from you. So we yes. just got stopped by the police. And this time it was to check if we had a fire extinguisher, which we did, but it was expired. expired. And then he wasn't satisfied with the fact that Steve had a fire extinguisher. So he then asked for the dang danger triangle. That one we didn't have, and that one we should have, so it's good to have it. Yeah, that matter. So we're here with Evans. <laughs> so you were explaining Enzule, it means? Enzule is what that's in Zema. Now we have three languages. Mixed. <laughs> Enzule uh -huh. is Enzema. Then Insio is Ashanti. Uh -huh. Then Insu is Fante. Mm. So we are walking out. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Good afternoon. The kids just probably had a field trip. Last time that we spoke, we got hold up by the police, and then after that we got hold up another again. time. This round we hold up three times yes. in one day. Yes, it took That's us a more record. than one hour. Yes. Because of the police yes. stopping us. An hour extra. We are now in the town of Stelz, the village of Stelz. Yes. Very cute. Yeah. Cute little old town. Yeah, it's, this is how it should be. It would look like when people say we want to back to the old age. Yes. Somebody watch this car. Watch this car. Oh, nah, yeah. Hey. So do this, these two guys. Watch, my car. watch the car. Oh hey. wow, it's very shiny. And they make a photo for me. Ah, that's so cute. <laughs> wow. When did you make this? We are now on our way to the club. Yes, to the church. To the church. Night out, the nightlife of Takrani. Takora day. We are not in town, right? So, but we are more a little bit on the side branch of town. Yeah. But we
we saw a club that's I think it looked nice so let's see why are we back at the hotel yeah we are planning to do something I'm gonna cut that out so why are we now at the hotel because Kaylee planned to do something we are back because the club that we went to, it was only seating and then the party was supposed to start at 3.30 but I can never ever make it to 3.30 I think people just sleep Go up here And then they wake up at 2.30 Yes Go to the club Because on this road there were less police than the other roads we took yesterday. So I think today we will be fine with 15 cities. Uh, yes, that's my guess. If you give them five per per person. Uh, I think zero. I'm going zero. To go zero. Oh, okay. Let's see. If I win and it's like it's closer to 15 than it is to 10. Yes. Then I can get an ice coffee. Then you will buy zero. me an ice coffee. Then to zero. Yeah, closer to 15 than to zero. Yes. Then I will. You will buy me an ice coffee. No, for you. I can buy now. And if you win, then I will also get ice coffee. Yes, you get an ice coffee, <laughs> and then I will drink it. <laughs> so today I'm here with the colonel. We are here in front of the fort that she brought <laughs> on her back. And now people on YouTube are calling her the colonizer because they know Kelly did it. But remember, I'm a Ghanaian. And I always think about the other side. Our own people sold us out. It's like selling my own sister, my own family to outsiders. But if the, the people from Europe didn't offer the money, they Doesn't know matter. people maybe needed money. Doesn't so. Matter. If somebody offer money for my sister, I will not give mm -hmm, my sister away. True. It doesn't matter how much money you have. So we should look at ourselves. That will not repeat again. But history will always repeat. Sell all everything that we have to the outsiders and our people stay poor. So we have just returned from our amazing weekend at your sister's in Takrade. But now it's time to discuss something else mm. because we're going to talk about what if your partner wants to change you. Mm -hmm. We already have a video about what if your partner wants you to go to the gym or you want your partner to go to the gym. So let's talk about all the other ways in which you can want to change your partner. You can change people, but sometimes we want to change somebody. And most of the time it's, it's not a very healthy way. We want to change somebody to become what we want for example we will tell somebody they are being rude but maybe they are just being truthful because the truth hurts they get offensive so they want to change you they will try to say to you like you are you are a bad person but don't you think in a relationship you have to live with each other 24 7 almost yeah. is it not important to keep on changing it's maybe even good for the relationship to ask someone to change yeah so you need not not force them because if you force somebody they will not change so sometimes you can tell somebody like hey this what you are doing is not doing you good and then then maybe if they really don't like it themselves they will change but if you don't like it and somebody likes it then they will not change and then so you're saying if you are the one that doesn't like it and you're asking somebody else to change that because you don't like it but they like it mm -hmm. then they're not going to change it yeah even if it would be something important so let's say in a relationship if somebody wants the other person to arrange more dates maybe be more romantic asking for more dates while the person does already their best is asking for impossibility you cannot tell somebody to go from eight to ten by force but if the person do zero 
and you ask them to go for a five or a six and they don't want to do that, then it's a big gap between you and that partner. And that gap, I'm telling you, will never be closed. You can expect a three, but sometimes the three is not enough for you. So you say a person can change, but only a little bit and only if they want to themselves. They can never make a big change. Not, not in a short time in a relationship. Most of the time after the three months, then you see that the bad stuff and then you starting to want to change the people. If you are a very patient person, you can change them from zero to six, maybe in six years. But that's why I say you go from zero to three, not zero to six. I think the belief of I'm like this and I cannot change anything is just very easy to say. Oh, I'm just yes. like this. Yes. Just deal with it. You picked me to be in a relationship with. You can either go out or accept me for who I am. So I think it is fair to ask your partner to change, mm -hmm. but also expect that things don't change. Yes. And then if things don't change, yes. reassess for yourself. Is this going to be worth it? Because often women, we fall in love with the potential of someone instead of falling in love yes. with who the person really is. A change is not always a bad thing that people say to you. It can also be very positive. We give personal training. We want to change them. They come to us for change to something that they know it will benefit for the rest of their life, whatever they do, self-esteem, their looks, everything. So sometimes people see something in you that they don't like what you say and they want to change you so that you become the best version of yourself. It's very difficult to know when that person wants the best for you or that person wants something out of you. So think about this when you hear this. Don't think a change is a bad thing. No, sometimes it's good. So let us know in the comments what you think and also which topic would you want us to discuss next. Ambition made you do it? Let's go. Let's go.